Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Maple and Home. My name is Amanda. Today's video, I set out with the intention of making a second part to my spring cleaning, but that will have to wait a little bit because I realized that my home just needed kind of a reset. I was super behind on quite a few tasks and I just felt like I needed to take care of them before I got into the more deep cleaning tasks that I wanna get done. I will also probably do a little more spring decorating as well before I get to the rest of the spring cleaning, specifically the master bedroom. One of the tasks that I was just so behind on was the laundry, not necessarily actually washing anything, but the folding. I have a huge problem when it comes to folding laundry. I will put things through the washer or the dryer and then I will completely put off folding it all. So we will end up with two or three hampers full of things to fold, mostly linens rather than clothes to be honest. I used a lot of time this particular morning to catch up on a lot of that. It felt so good to get it all taken care of. I folded a ton of laundry. I also washed a lot as well. If you're going to do laundry, you might as well do it all. But I did only film folding my younger son's clothes, as I'm sure no one really wants to watch me fold laundry for one whole video. That would be a little bit boring, I would think. Jump into the car on a Friday night. I want to drive with you. Looking for a bar in the nearest town. I've never seen a sky so blue. We don't ever play it in the night. is young. It doesn't matter what we do. There ain't nobody like. There ain't nobody like. You look so beautiful. And I'm so lucky to be yours. And you take it. I just want to take a quick second here to welcome you all to my channel, whether you're new or returning. I so appreciate you taking the time to watch. Like I mentioned earlier, my name is Amanda and I'm a stay-at-home mom to two little boys. I love sharing home decorating and other homemaking videos. So if you enjoyed today's video or you love home decorating too, be sure to subscribe. I would love to have you join the channel community. I was at the wrong place at the right time Cause suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes We were conversing into the night sky When you took my hand said let's leave now Don't wanna be shy I will let my guard down Don't wanna be shy So while my older son was at preschool and my younger son napped, I went downstairs to take care of the first floor and I just really wanted to straighten up and vacuum and mop the dining room and living room. I did clean the floors of the kitchen very recently, so I didn't tackle those at the same time. I also do try to break up the 
vacuuming and the mopping, they're just very big tasks for the first floor since we have basically a big great room. And I find that with big tasks like that, I can get really discouraged and I can lose focus. So breaking them up and doing them on different days really helps with that. I started by putting away all the toys in the living room and straightening up the pillows and blankets on the sofa. After the living room, I cleaned off the dining table and wiped it down. I used the seventh generation wood cleaner as much as possible on this table, unless I forget. Sometimes I'll be using the multi-purpose cleaner in the kitchen and then I will forget to switch it out when I go to the table. I just find that multi-purpose cleaners tend to leave a residue on the wood, but that the wood cleaner doesn't. Let me tell you this, let me tell you right now Your exquisite kiss still burning Didn't know I missed this passion in life Now I'm addicted So now let me tell you why What is up with your smile? It's impossible, not melting Irresistible when I look through your eyes Not even sky's the limit I used to be satisfied After a quick vacuum to clean up any crumbs, I mopped the floors. I use what's called an E cloth, like the letter E, with water. I just soak it with water. I have laminate hardwood floors, and they can be very temperamental when it comes to liquids. And I find that the plain water dries really quickly. It doesn't leave a stickiness or residue on the floor, both of which I appreciate. If you haven't noticed, I tend to be hyper aware about any kind of residue or stickiness, which is why I love when a cleaner doesn't do that. And I find that just the water with the e-cloth when mopping these floors just work better than the cleaners anyway. I feel like I don't have to work as hard when I use it. After tackling the dining room, I did the same in the living room, vacuuming and mopping. As you can see, I did move the coffee table. There were a lot of crumbs and toys and stuff that had accumulated underneath there and it really just needed to be moved and get a good clean down there. There were a couple spots of what looked like spilled coffee so I did get some carpet cleaner for that as well. I've been trying my best for a while trying to please everyone who's around me I've been putting on my fake smile even though I'm wasting time I don't want to be trapped in a box trying to be like the rest but I'm I just want to go my own way, gonna let the past burn down, cause honestly don't want to be stuck in more conversations with you, with you, I'm gonna leave it all behind, find myself, I'm gonna start with new. yeah, I'm on my way now.
While I waited for the floors in the dining room and the living room to dry, I cleaned up the dishes and wiped up the kitchen countertops and stove top. These are daily tasks for me, sometimes even multiple times a day. And while I'm waiting, I was really on a productive roll, so I just felt like I should get it all done. You've told me more than once to show you my intention. My brain gets blocked at times, but now somehow I'll give you my attention. You've got to know that I, I ain't a person who understands all the clockwork of a romance. You make me feel so On. If you're gonna be moving on solo, wait a second, cause they're playing the best song. I'll be there if you reach out to me. Finally, I put away all the Christmas and winter linens, which have been kind of just sitting in the master bedroom since I decorated for spring downstairs. I use space bags to store most of the pillows, blankets, and bed linens because we just don't have a ton of storage space in our house. The space bags allow me to put so much more in our linen closet than I would be able to do otherwise. That is all for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I will be returning to spring decorating videos next week. I've got a shop with me planned, as well as my last spring decorate with me before it gets warm enough to start decorating for spring out on our front porch. Be sure to leave a thumbs up. It does so much to help support my channel, and I appreciate it so very much. And don't forget to leave a comment down below with your thoughts. I'll see you all in my next video. Bye for now. Thank you.